Hey everybody, and welcome to uh, another Let's Play One Shot. This time we're doing PETA's amazingly awful portrayal of Pokemon in Pokemon Black and Blue. Gotta free them all. So, yeah, PETA did it again. They took a Nintendo game and made a parody of it that is essentially, uh, well... It essentially portrays Pokemon in a way that is absurd. Now, if you don't remember, um, oh, okay, so, yeah. If you don't remember, um, they did this with Super Mario 3D Land when it initially came out last year. Saying that, um, that he schooned at raccoon skins. So that he could fly, which is ridiculous. He got a magic leaf. And that's... And it gave him a raccoon suit. And he could fly. Nothing wrong there. Now look at this. Okay, Pikachu is attacking... Charon, or Sharon, or however you pronounce this... Character's name. Attacking him... Um, because he got free. And basically... Um, it's like your average Pokemon game. I mean, you know, you can you, you can choose to fight or switch Pokemon. So there's no items, and there's no run feature. But basically, each Pokemon has two um, attacks that will lower stats, and two attacks that actually do damage. Um, the opponents usually only have one or two attacks, and there's stuff like. You know the choke collars and you know those cha or the, and those tail chopper things. So yeah, Let's see we're going to use Thundershock and take him out. Yeah, so he's after him with a with a lightning bolt. Pikachu, as the Pokemon are not yours to abuse, Sharon. We exist for our own reasons. We're just Pokemon. This is what you were bred to do. Oh come on, even you know that. What a weak argument that is. Well, my other Pokemon doesn't want freedom. She's a well-behaved Pokemon. Oh, yeah. By the way, this is going to come off, um, ironically. It's going to turn around ironically on him. So, yeah. If you believe that, give her the choice. Fine, Tepig. Tepig joins the party. What? But I'm the one who feeds you. Doesn't that mean anything to you? Uh, apparently not. So you can name Tepig whatever you want. Um... I don't know, what should I name her? Uh, never mind. Alright, let's get going, Pikachu. I haven't had a good walk in a long time. <laughs> yeah, I see. Oh. Oh, oh god. Nurse Joy, what did they do to you? Yeah. Yeah, so, basically, Nurse Joy, man, she's like one of those people who's like, Hey, I like Pokemon. I don't like seeing them get her. Blah, 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 blah. And... Yeah, she's like the animal rights activist in this game. And look at the lovely terrain. Barbed wire fences, bear traps, blood pouring from the trees. Isn't it ironic that this was released in October? I don't know. And I honestly am not paying too much attention to this text. Yeah, some of us who we working together. Here's a treasure chest. And can you guess what the treasure chest has in it? I gave three choices. One, a good Pokemon game. Two, not um two, brain scratch commentaries commentary over this game. Or three, a wallpaper for your room, not for your computer. Let's see what it has in it. Ooh, man, it's a video. Oh, look, little piggies. Ooh, a puppy. Oh, what, what the heck? What the heck? What? What the? Oh, oh, God. Oh, oh God. So, yeah, it, it's just one of PETA's many videos that shows mistreatment of animals. I don't even know what that thing was. Pigs. Hmm. Ah, yes. 
Ah, uh, yes. Well, I don't care about that. Uh, the global terminal, I don't even know what that is. Hmm. Yeah, so the sound wasn't working there for a second. Alright. Oh, oh, oh god, Professor Juniper, what did they do to you? Ah. Yeah, so they gave her syringes. That's neat, I guess. Huh. Okay. As a scientist who's decided Pokemon, you should know better than anyone else that there's strong evidence that Pokemon feel pain just as humans do. It's not about what Pokemon feel. Humans are more important. Let's end this right now. Fight. Mm, group hug. We'll lower her defenses. And then we'll go it for a killing blow. Oh no, not dissection. Uh. Alright. Uh, yeah, let's try that again. Well, we'll probably die, but we wouldn't have killed her before, so at least Tepic will take her out. Ugh. Is that, like, her only attack? Because I think so. Alright, go Tepic! Yeah. Alright, use Ember! Yeah! It's perfective. Oh no, not a section. Oh, Tepic, why? I, I don't get it. Like, what's with the hole in the brain area? Like, seriously? It's, uh, that's kind of weird. I mean, yeah, he's a Pokemon. Yeah, I mean, it shows that he's got a cut in his head and stuff. But, like, that doesn't really, like, I don't know. It just it looks weird. It looks like Frankenstein-ish kind of thing, you know? You'll be alright, I can see how strongly you believe that. I don't really care about that. In the meantime, we're going to be the best if you take my Pokemon. Okay, that's just a weak reason to get this Pokemon. To get this Pokemon. Hmm, Snivy. Hmm, yeah. Smug. Leaf. Alright, there we go. Smug Leaf, join us on our mission to spread the word about Pokemon. About how Pokemon want to be treated! Ah. So you're saying Diglett's mouth is a nose? Hey look, another treasure chest! I hope it doesn't have another sad video in it. There's only one way to find out. Open. The world will be better without you. <laughs>